Well, it's interesting because on first reflection, it appears to be an oxymoron, really. To stir the waters is to, it would appear to disrupt peace. But in fact, it's uh, really the reverse. It's, it's considering what we have now and the status quo clearly isn't working. We've had 250 conflicts since the end of World War II. Something needs to change. So it's really looking at what we can do differently to give women agency in whatever field they find themselves, whether it's to provide microfinancing, to give them uh, economic empowerment in their communities, whether it's ending human trafficking and slavery, which they find themselves bound in, whether it's other forms of leadership and empowerment in the, in the civic sphere, in the political sphere. So it's really challenging what is accepted as norms and really trying to generate equality for women in all fields of life. Well, I find myself asking that question as well, of course, in my own role, and I'm re reasonably new in the role. Um, there are a number of ways that women are contributing already. There's the Vatican Association of Women Ambassadors, FAWA, that's recently established, and I applaud that initiative. There's also, of course, DIVA, the Association of Vatican Women. But I think it's important to look beyond that to women, uh, not only within the church, but outside the church too. Those who sometimes offer challenging perspectives from which we can learn. And I think uh, to reflect the, the uh, situation, the reality in secular society, the church needs to listen to all voices. Well, I'd hope very much that it would continue and it would thrive, and this is my first encounter with it. I'd hope it would be the first of many. So I would hope that, uh, as I said, it would, it would not only continue, but it would thrive. But more than that, that it would not just be the one day of the year, but that it would have an effect that would last well beyond that. And, and one uh, goal that would be very, uh, very much welcome to realise is that a member of the Curia would come along and participate in that. I think that would validate it very much. That would be very welcome. Uh, and also, of course, to see representation, as you already have, from all around the world, including my own region of Oceania.